got to tell you some folks about the gasoline crunch. <laughs> that's going to let us all eat them Arabs lunch. This whole darn thing was started out of greed, and they plumb forgot about the farmer's seed. It's been done in the mountains for the past hundred years, making moonshine folks out of old corn ears. So I took a little pipe and built myself a steel, and now I'm making brew with automobiles. When I put in the grain and throw in the mash, it'll burn the paint right off your dash. It'll flash your lights, fire your plugs, <laughs> it'll spin your wheels till it strips your lugs. When I take my time and I don't poop, I can make this stuff a hundred ninety poop. I gotta be careful about poop in the air, cause just a sniff will cut your hair. They said I had to make it strictly for the car To be sold at the pumps and not at the bar It's got the power of octane gas And one little drink will knock you on your And down at the station, like it or not They gotta sell it by the gallon and not by the shop There's crow and bean, who can name them all But they made us call ours Gas hall. There's regular ethyl and unleaded gas. At most of them stations, you happen to pass. We'll have three kinds from which to choose. Hooch, white lightning, and rot cut So take the old car when you make a little trip. Drive her by the station and give her a little dip. You can be as proud as a hound with pups when all your motor trouble is a case of hiccups. If she ever stops running and you need to be told, why just let her sleep it all on the side of the road. And when she's all hung over, just hang loose. I'm working on something out of tomato juice. My old Paul said he could remember when folks made something called bathtub gin. But now he says, I done gone too far trying to make a drunk out of the family car.